In this video, let's solve the lead code problem number 70, climbing stairs. Uh, let's understand the problem statement. We are climbing a staircase. It takes n step to reach to the top. Each time, you can either climb one or two steps. In how many distinct way can you climb to the top? Uh, let's take this example. There are two uh, steps are there then there are two ways to reach the one way is each step at a time that is one way to reach another way is uh, two step at a time then if there are two ways to reach this uh, if there are two steps if it is three there are three ways the first way is one step at a time the another way is one step and then two steps another way is two step and then one step uh, if you take this one, um, three, you can reach uh, three ways. How it is? Uh, three, two, one. Let's take this. Um, this takes uh, three time, three uh, distinct way to reach. Um, um, let's all let's check this if n is less than or equal to 1 then we can return n i'm going to use uh, dynamic uh, programming uh, for that uh, let's declare one variable int um, p equal to new int of size n plus 1 the size i'm going to store each uh, steps how many is way to reach if we are going to reach first there are one step there is one way to reach let's store this as one if there are two then there are two ways to reach from three onwards uh, if you sum these two there are three ways to reach if, if you want if you are reaching if there are three uh, states so you can reach three distinct way also if if we call some this previous two steps then you will get the result p of three is going to be p of two plus p of one if there are four uh, states you can reach p of three plus p of two times you so say this is going to be three then this is going to be five there are five distinct way to reach from this you can do the loop if it is more than three then you can do the loop i'm going to do this this i'm not going to use this this is going to be in our uh, programming uh, let's do the for loop for int i equal to starting from 3 i less than or equal to n i plus plus here let's store p of i equal to p of 3 basically then p of 2 which means p of uh, i minus 1 plus p of i minus 2 then finally uh, p of n contains the top uh, the number of ways to reach the n state so return p of n let's run the code return spell mistake uh, it is accepted let's submit This success it took uh, 0 millisecond faster than 100 percentage of java online submissions let's also solve this in uh, c sharp i don't think any change is needed you can just change the language c sharp you can paste the code it will work i think everything all other syntax looks perfect uh, this is commented code um, 
let's run the code and see whether this works yes it is it is accepted let's submit it is success it took 40 millisecond which is still faster than 68.38 percentage of c server online submissions uh, in the next video we will solve different decode problem uh, thanks for watching